Republicans and Democrats coming together in Pima County with one unified message. Why they're both telling supporters enough is enough. Thank you for joining us. I'm Valerie Cavazos. Pat Paris has the night off. We're talking about sign stealing. It's something that costs campaigns and candidates money and could cost violators money and land them in jail. Kega 9 Inch Sides, Craig Smith reports. A Pima Sheriff's airplane caught this video of a crime in progress. Two people snatching Trump campaign signs from the side of a road. They ended up arrested and charged. In Arizona, stealing or vandalizing a political sign is a criminal act that can hit you with a $750 fine and land you in jail for up to four months. Both major parties have had so many signs knocked down, defaced, or stolen. They've teamed up for a joint statement urging everyone to cut it out. But what's happening right now to both parties is that, you know, intersections are just being wiped out. Yeah, and this is childish. It's probably not going to change one vote. Um, spend your energy working for the candidate you support instead of instead of vandalizing signs if you really want to make a difference it's not as if stealing signs is new six years ago a school board candidate lost so many signs she planted a camera that caught a thief in the act both parties agree feelings are running especially high this election year but no one should be attacking someone's signs they say if you want to fight hard go ahead but fight fair Craig Smith, KGON 9, on your side.